either plays uh, Plant or Yoshi. Hey, it's Plant. He's a Yoshi. Um, I believe he also has. Who else? Did he? I saw a squad strike. He had one of the characters. Fox. He has a Fox. Fox. Okay. I doubt we're going to see the Fox here, though. Probably. I don't know okay, how good I got is. Mm -hmm. Kamikaze typically goes Plant unless he's really worried about losing, which yeah. case will go Yoshi. Let's see uh, what happens. I have no idea who I got plays. Do you? No idea. All right. No, this is my first time seeing we'll this see person. Me. So, it'll be interesting to see. Kamikaze you got a pretty solid plan, honestly. Does a really good job of zoning him out with neutral B. Yeah. Dude, I feel like Plant's neutral B is one of his best tools. Batui is yeah. honestly one of the best projectiles in the game. It really is. That thing lasts literally as long as you can see it. Yeah. It's insane. And we got okay. chain grabs on oh, okay. Samak. Let's go. Hype. <laughs> Maybe I got plays Mario. I don't know. LSD? Okay. I like I like it. Yeah, so this there was a baseball player, that was his name, LSD. Yeah. And coincidentally, he was a big fan of psychedelics. Oh. He actually played a no-hit pitch game while tripping on LSD, <laughs> which is insane. That's legendary. That is crazy, right? And considering his name was literally LSD. All right, we got Piranha Ooh, Play coming out versus Donkey, Donkey Kong. Kong. I think it's pretty obvious. Okay, I definitely would prefer Piranha Plant in this matchup. Yeah, definitely. I do play a bit of Yoshi myself, so. I don't, I don't really like Yoshi versus heavies. He's yeah, I feel like, you know, down air just hits so hard. Yeah. All right. All right, so far we got good combos right now. Ooh, see, like, look that at that. That neutral B to cover the platform landing is so good. 20 damage. Oh, that's oh huge damage He's coming already out. at 107. We're not even, like, 15 seconds in the match. If yeah, he that side B will do crazy damage if you're not careful it about it. It's insane. Right, Look at him covering like his ledge options too. What's yeah, going I, don't, I don't know how I feel about that neutral B there because if he had just jumped over it, that could have been bad for him. That's true. All right. I see he brought it back. It's pretty even, honestly. Yeah. Ooh, uh, yeah. Back air trade probably not that great for, honestly. Not against Plant, no, because nah. I mean, because Plant's pretty heavy. Yeah. Like yeah. he's gonna have to get some good damage before he can finish his stock. Plus, if you if you jump, you're gonna get more than likely gonna jump into the ball. Oh. Just tanking the damage from that, Ooh, and that is going to kill at yeah. 180. Man. Honestly, it's still, he's still pretty in this. He's just got to play a little more careful. Yeah, he's, he's rushing in, and it looks like he keeps running. Into oh, the and that My good God. forward okay. touch. Not taking. Wow. Oh, it's this hit. Okay, okay. I thought he lived for a second. Yeah. That's not me. Okay. All right. Where's your buddy go? Oh, I see him. He's talking. All right. Yeah. I'm counting on him. <laughs> I appreciate it. All right, and now up to 75 Ooh. already. Gets a back air for 16, but now he's up to 95%. It's not looking good for him. He's yeah, like he just keeps going for stuff, man. I'd like to see him try to at least get back on stage before trying anything risky. Oh okay, my that God. was a good that roll. That was the boldest forward or dash attack I've ever seen in my life. Yo, Donkey Kong's dash attack is really good, and it stays out for longer than you think, man. It like, is good, but if he had like done that a second later, yeah, he would have been hit by that of smash. So I think he's found his oh. Ooh, oh, that killed. I feel like if he had air dodge, he might have been able to live there. Maybe. But, you know. Man, he keeps getting hit with a spike ball. Yeah, Look at Mikazi that. Kamikaze doing a great job of racking up damage. Oh, my gosh. If he had gotten that neutral B, that would have been amazing. Yeah. It's pretty much making it so that Donkey Kong can't get above him directly. Like. Oh, nice. Oh, this jab. Jab bring combo. Him Let's see. Spike ball. Okay, good. That's what we want to see. There Block you go. the spike shield. balls. Well, the problem is, is it does so, look at how much shield damage that does. You can only true. do it so much. But yeah, see, that's a problem too. If he just holds it and you hit him. My plan? Oh, oh, I gotta shit. go. I'm oh, sorry. Good luck, man. You got it, dude. All right. What's up, stream? Kamikaze taking the first game. Piranha Plant planting his footing securely against the DK. Looks like they're deliberating over the stages. Very interested to see exactly what's going to go. Hey. hey, what's up? I heard you did pretty good. Yeah, you're good. Oh, oh sorry, that's my jacket. <laughs>
All right, so back in the fray, we've got Kamikaze, and who is he fighting? Um, I know his game thinks it's LSD. I, I forgot his name. I think I something. How did I forget his name that quick? What did you say? I something. I dumpster maybe? No, I don't think it's I dumpster. Okay, we'll see. Two I got. Oh, I got. That's I, what I, it I, is. I Okay, yeah, because we do have a player named High Dumpster here. Okay. Anyway, I got Kamikaze, game one. Kamikaze pulling out the plant again, as he did in doubles earlier today. Yeah, his plant is really aggressive. It's really good. Um, I got, he switched from DK into Young Link, so let's see how this is going to go for him. That's, uh, that's quite a change, but honestly, it's not one that's too unorthodox. That's, yeah, because he's doing a lot better, you know. It looks like he has, like, a lot of more options to deal with the plant's, like, gimmicks, you know, like the spike ball. I feel like spike ball was the real MVP of the last match, you know. It just covered every option DK had, so we couldn't even go, like, above him without getting hit by spike ball. There is that. Um, but, yeah, you know. Is that me they called? Wait. It was not me? Okay. Okay, I thought they called Rango for a minute. It's, it should be good, though, because I told Darius I'm on commentary anyway, so we're good. Anyway, uh, I got trying to make things happen. Kamikaze. Uh, very dangerous, but at the same time, a dangerous play of his own. Gimping and edge guarding I God's Youngling, taking the first stock. Ooh, and this times the bomb throw and actually hits the platform to take damage from it. It's interesting because Piranha Plant's uh, case of edge guarding is very low risk, high reward. Just because of how good his recovery is. He can just pretty much go like as deep as he wants to off stage. He really can. And that's definitely a big trait for a character that otherwise struggles in neutral. Yeah. I honestly would not be surprised if Piranha Plant got buffs, but as far as I'm going, as far as I'm looking, it would be for its neutral. Yeah. Because his edge guarding is definitely uh, among the best in the cast. Yeah, it's insane, man. Spike ball covers so many options alone, and then the poison cloud. And you had to do that because you oh. have to consider. I've just been called to station 20, so I'll be back. All right, I can take care of the rest of this match. Uh, as far as it's, it looks, uh, we are back down to two and two. Um. Yeah, Piranha Plant's edge guarding is really good. The two, let's see, they're playing a very, okay, I was gonna say, looking like a read game right there. Uh, Ayat initializes the offense with the boomerang. Both are good in projectiles. I would see Young Link a bit of, a little more so. Um, the thing about Piranha Plant is that with his own spike ball projectile, of which I believe is intangible, if it's not, you're free to correct me on chat, um, you can go through Young Link's projectiles except for his bomb. Assuming that the two just don't clash. So he doesn't really have to go in on Young Link. Ooh, all right, so I got it. Ooh, risky play. Risky, risky, risky. Just trying to get up there and a surprise down B. We do not see Piranha Plates down B very often, but we do see the spike balls all the time as it takes off. I got second stock. Kamikaze going in on fire. I mean, more than his bears. I got, ooh, very lucky pair right there. That was an incredibly close call right there. The second hit would have hit. Kamikaze would have lost the second stock, but it looks like now he has taken up the edge guarding and the ledge traps. He burned his poison mist. Oh my god. And he is still surviving after a second, uh, another fair. This time, the full hit. But no, based on the websites, Piranha Plant is the heaviest heavyweight in the game. Not super heavyweight. He's lighter than Incineroar, but heavier than Samus, Ike, Bowser Jr., and so forth. So it takes a good bit to get him a you know nice hit, finish him off. Um, either way, Kamikaze just lost the second stock. We are now in even stocks. Ellis down 50%. And counting. Ooh, boy. I see what he was trying to do there. The edge guard for the spike ball would have just prevented him from coming in. Wasn't enough, but he got back up on stage and just built an 88 more damage. Definitely looking like a risky stock. I was going to say he'd have to pull something big. I got botches the air dodge and loses his final stock. Kamikaze takes it 2 0. And I'm going to wait for my next match, but if I can find a co commentator, then you will certainly hear me back on. Rango out.
Hunger, still waiting for my next match. And I am joined by the man wearing what looks to be a Jisoo Art, Ness, and Lucas t-shirt. I'm Rego. Chandler, I mean Hugh. Chandler? Or Hugh. Hugh. Hugh? Yeah, that's my tag. Nice to meet you, Hugh. Nice to meet you. I saw you on commentary earlier, so I was yeah. kind of eyeing you when uh, I was good for a <laughs> second. Yeah, we have Big Play, formerly known as, uh, what, Phantom? Yeah. I didn't know that was a past tag. Uh, I played Big Play last it, time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 